name is Jennifer Milano. I'm an assistant professor at the University of Cincinnati. Um, I completed neurology residency at West Virginia University and a behavioral neurology fellowship at the Mayo Clinic in Rochester, Minnesota, and a sleep medicine fellowship at Vanderbilt University in Nashville, Tennessee. Well, I think in terms of just as a general neurologist, for me, the annual meeting um, was just a, a a wealth of information in terms of the different types of courses that were there. Um, it was able to, I was able to supplement the things um, that I didn't necessarily get in terms of didactics um, when I was a resident. Um, you know, because certain, if you're from a smaller program, um, you know, sometimes you don't have uh, you know, a full sleep program or a full behavioral neurology program. And so for me, I was able to take courses in those areas of interest to really see if that was where I wanted to go in terms of my career. Um, so in terms of content, of course, I think the academy provides a lot of great educational value, um, both in terms of what you, in terms of, um, you know, the, the, the medical knowledge as well as the practical knowledge that you need to, to have it to be a neurologist. Um, so as a general neurologist, that's the primary thing. Um, as a, as a, as an ac as someone who's interested in academics, I think, you know, the academy or my involvement with the academy has really helped me in terms of developing my leadership skills. Um, you know, as a junior member of the education committee when I first started, um, I remember being very much in awe of the people that were around me and the people that I were working with. Um, but they were so welcoming in terms of listening to my comments and leading me in the right direction that that in turn gave me some confidence um, along the way. And as my involvement with the academy has um, continued, you know, that has again developed and evolved into leadership positions as well. So I think um, those have been invaluable skills for me, um, not only within the academy, but also when you know I'm talking with colleagues or you know looking for job positions, you know, when I was looking for job positions and whatnot. So I tell people that um, you know I, I think that I I am an example of what the academy can do for someone, um, not only in terms of general. Um, knowledge and growth, but also in terms of leadership development. And I strongly encourage um, anyone, including junior members um, of, of the academy, to pursue leadership positions here because they will, you know, the staff and the, and the, um, and the mentors that you'll, you'll have will nurture you um, along your way.